Well, everyone, I have returned for a second and final video. Ladies and gentlemen, sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some to eat, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on this subject, and of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. Now, in this video, it will be strictly in our article. Oh, I forgot to mention, I do have social media accounts, but don't worry, I'll discuss this after this part of the video is over. Now, let's begin here. Already then, now probably you know or don't know that Manny Rose explained about her release from the WWE. She was on a talk show. I don't know who the hell she was, so I do apologize. If you've seen the video, let me know down below. If you've seen the, she was on a talk show. Okay, it's on every social media platform. On YouTube, probably Twitch, Twitter, and even Instagram. Okay, now I'm going to do the best that I could discuss this matter, so please have patience. Former WWE superstar Manny Rose has opened up on her career with the promotions and her shocking release last month. I know I'm not saying that one name correctly, I do apologize. Rose was cut from WWE after high upper learning of the contact shared on her website one day after losing the NXT Women's Championship. The ex-superstar was earning far more than her website than she she did with the WWE contract. I just added it in there. So this was a major blessing for her because she's making tons of money out of the WWE company. Sorry, got a little the WWE part messed up. I do apologize. So I'm very happy for her, but she's kind of sad how they approach her, you know? So who's wrong, who's right in this predicament, you know? She says she's very heartbroken. Hey, everybody gets fired. Everybody gets released. So, you know, do you think she messed up? Do you think she went over the boundaries? Because WWE, at the time, was perfectly fine when she was shooting nice, beautiful photos in bikinis. They were okay with that. But she did not go into details about what kind of photos, you know. If she did, I must have did not watch a whole interview, but... WWE really don't need her at all anymore, okay? And I doubt it that WWE will ever bring her back. I doubt it. And I guarantee WWE probably saw the interview, the talk show. I guarantee someone did it and probably uh, told Triple H or Stephanie or HBK about it. You know, I'm assuming. You never know. You never know. So... She's perfectly fine. You could tell she's very happy. She's making tons of money, but she's hurt. But do you think she will really? Do you think many roles will get over this issue? Do you think WWE will reach out to her again and see? You know what? Let's make things. Let's make it work. And I want you to come back. Highly unlikely. It's not gonna happen. Okay. I love to see her back, but it's not gonna happen. You know. And she says she. Wrong the girls in from NXT, you know, she had a nice stable. She, she was the longest running NXT world women's champion in NXT. And then out of nowhere, WWE decided to let her drop the belt on a free TV on that, you know, on Tuesday night, like t today, you know. So, um, who you think, once again, who you think is wrong and who you think is right? Do you think W should want a different direction of discussing this with Manny Rose? I think they just call her up and tell her you are released from the company. I'm assuming how that's how it works. So that's very sad, you know. But like I said before, everybody in sports entertainment gets released. It's not really a big deal. I mean, for us, but for them, it is. She's not hurting for money. She's perfectly fine, you know. 
I know I'm not saying all this information correctly. I do apologize. But all the information down below. So once again, do you think that we will ever considering bring her back? Probably it's never going to happen. Especially if she's doing an adult website. She's making tons of money. So she's perfectly fine. I doubt that she will return for the Women's Royal Rumble coming up later this month. I have flipping doubt it. I really doubt it. I'd be surprised if Manny Rose and Triple H will make a discussion about her return. I don't think so. But you never say never. But once she's done, maybe once she's done doing those kind of photos, maybe that we will consider bringing her back. But right now, it's not going to happen. Okay? So once again, who do you think is the fault in this? Do you think W should approach Man Rose of not releasing her? Or instead of a phone call, they should just have a one-on FaceTime or face-to-face, -face, like a sit-down. You know what I'm saying? But probably I'm wrong. I'm always wrong with these status. So please get back with me. Now, follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. If you want to be part of the Robert Show, that's fine and dandy. If not, then don't worry about it. Now, back to wrestling. Excuse me. Later this month, I'll go live in 11 color for the Men's Royal Rumble. Who will return and debut. Same thing for the women's. The returns and debuts. Hopefully, it's going to be a good sh uh, show. Hopefully, everyone will be participating. And enjoy the rest of your Tuesday. Sorry if I kind of messed up the, 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 the article. I do apologize. But you guys create it for yourself. Are you guys happy for Man Rose? What's she doing her? In her new career right now, or you miss her in the WWE. Peace out, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Enjoy the rest of your Tuesday.